I like my pears with a little crunch, but with lots of juice and sweet and sticky. But that's the biggest problem, knowing when the pear is ripe. Pears are a complex fruit. They can be happily cold stored for up to 10 months. However, controlling when they ripen is something that we've traditionally left to chance. But there's one fruit farmer in Kent who's going that extra mile to produce the perfect pear. Clive Baxter grows over a thousand tons of pears each year. He's gone out on a limb, investing huge sums in new technology to create a room where he can control the ripening process. And he's about to let me into his secret. So it's, it's similar to a cold store, except that in this case we're actually putting warm air in and then the air is, is sent out above this ceiling and it's forced down through the, through the actual pallets of fruit and then it's taken back up through the centre there. And then sucked uh, up through here. Yeah. So, so there's like a, a circular motion, it's forced air. Yeah. But it doesn't yeah. feel that warm in here, but obviously warm enough just to ripen them up slowly. Yes. As you probably know, when you put your normal pear in a fruit bowl, you have a very firm pear quite often. Then maybe for a day, mm. you have the perfect pear. And then very quickly after that, it's completely gone and it just, it just falls apart. The perfectly ripened pears out of here, they still stay firm but ripe for several days, whereas a, a standard pear that just ripens in your house does not. This method of warming fruit has its origins in the ready-to-eat ripe avocado system developed in Norfolk. How would you look for, for ripeness in a, in a pear? I apply pressure with my thumb. Just, should, just give a little bit as you push down with your thumb. Regardless of the colour? Regardless of the colour. Yeah. After just a couple of days in the warming room, Clive's pears are sent straight to the supermarket. So Clive, how has this helped your business? Well, it's very popular with the customers because uh, generally in the UK, pear sales are quite flat. Perfectly ripened pear sales are really increasing. And you can see why when you start to eat these pears. So it's been well received by the public, even though they have to pay a couple of pennies more uh, because they've got a perfectly ripe and really tasty product at the end of it. Yeah, well, it's like anything else, isn't it? People will go to your restaurant because you do something a little bit different than, than the ordinary. And in the same way, as you're, if you're getting something that genuinely tastes that much nicer, most people are willing to pay a bit more money for it. Good. It's great to meet someone who's so passionate about growing pears. But not just that, prepared to go that extra mile to deliver ripe and beautiful British pears. Perhaps we are already on the cusp of the pear revival.